let's look at this uh, lumbar uh, spine MRI okay again you can see there is a straightened uh, lumbar spine due to paraspinal muscle spasm uh, there is some alteration of signals in this situated image in the L4 inferior and L5 superior end plate let's uh, keep uh, the T1 side by side so that we can see what's happening all right so let me see if you guys can see this properly yes all right let me just adjust the window yeah perfect so you can see that there is a T1 and T2 hyper intense signal at the end plates of L4 and L5 okay and you can see the disc is dehydrated appearing dark on T2-weighted images with protrusion uh, prob so we will confirm if there is extrusion of the disc material or if it's just protrusion you can see that it is a sub ligament you can see the posterior longitudinal ligament pushed away due to the disc that is coming out okay now let's let's put stir side by side so that we can see what's happening let me see if you guys can see the stir as well yeah it's visible so now you can see over here there is t1 t2 hyper intense t1 hyper intense and relatively uh, you would say that it's iso intense or uh, signals are fairly suppressed in the um, uh, fat suppressed stir sequence okay so this is typical of t1 t1 bright t2 bright so this is a type 2 modic end plate change all right which is with fat suppressed signal in the uh, stir sequence all right now let's have a look at the axial section so that we can have a better uh, view of what's happening in at the level of the disc okay so i zoom in i zoom in and let me adjust the window a bit so that you can see it yeah i think this gives a fairly good idea what's happening so you can see here there is a broad posterior disc bulge at l4 phi and if you notice over here it's more centrally and little towards the left lateral recess there is a breach of the annulus and there is protrusion of the disc it is impinging upon the thecal sac anteriorly and left anterolaterally okay while this is a diffuse uh, bulge accompanied by an annular tear so there is more uh, involvement of the left side lateral recess and neural foramen and to a lesser extent the right lateral recess all right 